Hello friends! How are you? In general, it is not a good idea to feed your dog human food. Dogs are not able to digest a lot of human foods, and these items can cause serious health problems for them. There are some specific foods that you should never give your dog. When I say never, I mean never, even in small amounts, because they can be harmful or even deadly. There are foods that we have at home that you should never give your dog, no matter how tempting it may be. As much as you like him, as much as you think it won't be anything serious, like, for example, a little piece of chocolate, a fried potato, a bread, these actions can be expensive. Even though some human foods are safe for dogs to eat, it's important not to give them any food that isn't specifically intended for dogs. Human food can be tempting for dogs, but it can also be dangerous. So it's better not to take risks, isn't it? You will be surprised with the number 4 food that you may possibly be giving him without knowing it and little by little your dog is dying. Because for dogs it is a silent symptom. Don't forget to click like. If you haven't registered, register now and don't forget to activate the bell so you know everything. Pets Connection 15 Foods or Food Groups You Should Never Give Your Dog Because You Might Kill Them Number 15, Avocado. You can think of avocados as healthy, however, they are anything but healthy for dogs. Avocados contain a substance called persin that can act as a poison for dogs. Eating even a small amount of avocado can cause vomiting and diarrhea in dogs. Avocado leaves, fruits and sets contain persin, so it's important to keep avocados away from pets. Make sure they never find an avocado pit on the ground. They can chew and that can be a problem. Avocados, if eaten, can also trigger fluid buildup in the lungs and chest. This can lead to difficulty in breathing and death from oxygen deprivation. Number 14, Garlic. Garlic is toxic to dogs because of a compound called THIOSULPHATE. Dogs cannot digest this compound, which can cause vomiting and diarrhea. In severe cases, garlic toxicity can lead to organ failure. For this reason, it is important to keep garlic out of the reach of dogs. Garlic contains methylallyl sulfide, which are responsible for garlic's strong odor. These sulfides can cause liver damage in dogs and can also lead to anemia. Garlic is a vegetable that we use extensively in our meals, so think twice before sharing your steak dipped in garlic and gravy with your dog. Number 13, Macadamia Nuts. Macadamia nuts are an excellent source of dietary fiber as well as rich in minerals, vitamins, fiber and antioxidants. It is very good for us humans, however, dogs have different metabolisms from us. These nuts can be fatal to dogs, but only if a large amount is ingested. As little as 2.4 grams per kilogram of body weight can cause clinical signs of poisoning in dogs, including muscle tremors, weakness, hindquarter paralysis, vomiting, fever, and accelerated heartbeat. The most severe cases can result in paralysis and even death. If ingested with chocolate, the mixture can be fatal. You are enjoying our video so far so before we move on to the next food, don't forget to leave your like and subscribe to our channel so you never miss our videos. Number 12, Chocolate. Chocolate toxicity is one of the most common causes of poisoning in dogs. Chocolate contains a lethal component called theobromine, which is found in all types of chocolate, but dark chocolate contains more. If a dog consumes even a small amount of chocolate, it can be fatal. Chocolate also contains caffeine, and some sugar-free chocolates may contain xylitol, and it's the next banned food on the list, which is also toxic to dogs. Symptoms associated with eating chocolate can include hyperactivity, vomiting, diarrhea, pancreatitis, abnormal heart rate and seizures. So try to resist the temptation to give your dogs chocolate, although it tastes great, it's not good for them. Number 11, Xylitol. Xylitol is found naturally in fruits and vegetables such as raspberries, strawberries, cauliflower or mushrooms. Is an artificial sweetener often found in jumps, chewing gum, peanut paste, and certain diet foods. While safe for human consumption, it can have quick and traumatic consequences for dogs as it increases insulin in the body which can lead to a drop in blood sugar. Just a small amount of xylitol can be deadly to a dog. 
so it's important to keep any product that contains xylitol away from your pet. Signs that a dog has ingested xylitol include vomiting, lethargia, and seizures. And here's the tip. Always check the list of ingredients on your food before sharing it with your dog. Number 10. Yeast Dough The next time you bake a loaf of bread, keep it away from your dog. Even though it looks like a tasty snack, bread and pasta can cause alcohol poisoning in dogs. The yeast will ferment in your intestines, twisting your intestines, which can be very dangerous. Some of the symptoms of alcohol intoxication in dogs include vomiting, diarrhea, loss of coordination and difficulty breathing. It may not kill your little friend, but it will certainly be unpleasant and painful. So save it by keeping the yeast away from their curious, adorable snouts. Number 9. Cooked Bones There is a common misconception that all bones are bad for your dog. However, this is only true for cooked bones. Cooked bones cause inflammation in the stomach tissue and can even puncture the stomach or intestines. On the contrary, raw bones, in some cases, are good for dogs as they help clean teeth and provide important nutrients. So if you want to give your puppy a bone as a snack, make sure it is not cooked, as it can have serious consequences. And please don't put salt on food number two on our list you will understand. Number 8. Grapes and Raisins Grapes and raisins can be toxic to dogs, so it's best to keep them out of your dog's reach. The exact reason they are poisonous is unknown, but even a small amount can make your dog sick. These sweet snacks can cause vomiting, lethargia, and ultimately, kidney failure in dogs. A dog's kidneys cannot process the high levels of sugar in grapes and raisins, which leads to health problems. Owners should avoid giving these foods to their dogs altogether. Number 7. Caffeine. If you're one of those dog owners who gives your furry friend a sip of coffee every now and then, you might want to stop. Coffee can cause irreparable damage and even caffeine poisoning if consumed in large amounts by your dog. This risk extends from tea, coffee and energy drinks to espresso coffee beans covered in chocolate. Just like humans, dogs can suffer from heart problems, seizures, and even death after consuming too much caffeine. Symptoms of caffeine intoxication in dogs include restlessness, excessive thirsty and urination, vomiting, diarrhea, increased heart rate, muscle tremors, and breathing breathing. So make sure you don't leave half-full mugs around the house. Number 6. Leeks and Onions Leeks and onions are common ingredients in many recipes, but they are also dangerous for dogs. These pungent ingredients can actually destroy a dog's red blood cells, leading to anemia. They can also cause gastrointestinal problems, including vomiting and diarrhea. In severe cases, garlic and onions can even be fatal to dogs. So if you're cooking with garlic or onions, keep your dog out of the kitchen. And if your dog eats any of these ingredients, contact your veterinarian immediately. Number 5. Alcohol. Did you know that alcohol is toxic to dogs? Dogs and alcohol should never mix. Even a small amount can cause vomiting, diarrhea, central nervous system depression, coordination problems, and difficulty breathing. Just like humans, the smaller the dog, the greater the effect. In severe cases, alcohol poisoning can be fatal. Experts estimate that 8 mm of pure alcohol per kilogram can cause death in 12 to 24 hours, so alcohol is no joke especially for dogs. Number 4. Sugary Foods Sugar out. You should never feed your dog sugar. Sugary foods may be delicious, but they're not good for humans or dogs. Obesity, oral health problems and especially diabetes can result from excessive consumption of sugar. For dogs, this means an increased risk of developing pancreatitis, liver disease and cancer. In the short term it is difficult to notice these symptoms, but over time it will become very evident. The risk that a dog has of suffering diabetes due to sugar consumption is very high. Number 3. Milk, Cheese, Ice Cream and Other Dairy Products A large percentage of dogs are intolerant to cow's milk because it lacks the enzyme needed to break down the sugar in milk. This can cause gastrointestinal problems such as diarrhea and vomiting. When a dog eats dairy, the high levels of fat in the milk and cream can cause pancreas inflammation. 
The only time dairy is safe for dogs is when it is formulated specifically for them, such as dog formulas or ice cream specially made for dogs. In general, it's best to avoid giving your dog cow's milk and instead give him water or a pet-specific drink. Giving dairy to your four-legged friend is serious and can be fatal. So it's important that you don't share your ice cream with your pup. Number 2. Salt. For dogs, even a small amount of salt can be dangerous. Symptoms of sodium ion poisoning in dogs include vomiting, diarrhea, tremors, excessive thirsty and urination, and seizures. Treatment usually involves inducing vomiting and giving the dog fluids to clear the salt from its system. So the next time you open that bag of chips, try to keep your dog away from you. Give him a dog treat, or even a soft, wet food, this way he'll ignore you and you can eat your potato or salty popcorn in peace. Number 1. Seeds and Fruit Pits Sharing fruit with your dog can be a fun and healthy experience, but it's important to remember that pits and seeds can pose a danger to your pet. These objects can clog a dog's digestive tract, leading to dangerous health complications. That's why it's always important to be careful when giving fruit to your dog. Be sure to remove all pits and seeds before offering the fruit to your pet. That's why it's always important to be careful when giving fruit to your dog. Be sure to remove all pits and seeds before offering the fruit to your pet. Fruits such as watermelon, peach, acerola, guava, mango, and others. Even if your dog doesn't eat the pit or seeds, he can still get sick from eating too much fruit. Now answer me something, have you ever tried to give your dog a hug and he growled at you? Or, don't you usually take your four-legged friend to the vet? Yes, have you bathed your dog and used your soap or shampoo? It could be that you are making some mistakes. On the final screen, 14 things you should stop doing to your dog. Maybe you're making some mistakes and didn't know. So click there and I'll explain. A big hug.